So John Morant does this a lot, but I've never understood why more people don't. And I'm talking about rolling the ball up the floor or just letting it sit there in your backcourt to waste clock and protect the lead if you're up. Because for example, last night Memphis set near 30 points versus a Hornets with three minutes to go in the third, and so Josh Marley wanted to take time off the clock to decrease the chance of an improbable comeback, doesn't touch the ball just letting it sit there so the shot clock doesn't start, allowing him to take off 27 seconds on the clock. And a lot of this was Charlotte's fault, I mean just no urgency by them just standing in the front court thinking Ja was about to pick it up, and this strategy may not seem that significant, but take the Grizzlies game versus the Wolves a couple weeks back where Morant did the same exact thing on multiple possessions in the fourth quarter, which added up to him taking over a full minute on the clock in a game that was within 10 points. And you could definitely argue that it's unfair and that the league should make a rule change, but for now, I'm not sure why more teams and players don't exploit this while holding leads.